Hi guys, it's me, Teacher Gon. In our today's video, we will talk about the order of operations. And technically, this one is intended for those people who are reviewing for the civil service examination. And today, we have two questions to talk about. This problem and this problem. So without further ado, let's do this topic. Let's have here item number one or question number one. It says here, Evaluate 16 minus the quantity of 24 minus 8 plus 22 times 8 minus 8. So for this problem, guys, we will use the concept of PEMDAS for the order of operations. Now, guys, in PEMDAS not in this parentheses, exponent, multiplication division can be interchanged depending on the mo na sa left and then as well as with addition and subtraction. So let, let me copy first the given. We have this one, 16 minus the quantity of 24 minus 8 plus 22 times 8 minus 8 because a lot of people are still confused about the order of operations. So since no sa atin si letter P, we will start first with the parentheses. Ito unahin natin guys, in 24 minus 8. So, and technically, we will copy 16, copy 16 with same symbol, minus the answer for 24 minus 8, which is also 16. And then, since we have 22 times 8, again, 22 times 8, that is plus 176. You can use your your pen paper to multiply manually, but this time 22 times 8 is 176, and we will copy minus 8. As you can see, we already performed P parentheses and then the multiplication. So what we have now is 16 minus 16 plus 176 minus 8. So we can still simplify this part. We have 16 minus 16, which is equal to 0 plus 176 minus 8 is equal to 168. So what do you think is the answer? The answer is 168. So for this problem, the correct answer is letter D. 168. Now let's continue with the second problem. By the way guys, before we continue plus the next problem natin, Sa mismong PEMDAS, ano talaga, kailangan nyo lang ng familiarity about the problem para hindi kayo malilito. Kasi, kaya nalilito yung mga tao dahil hindi sila sanayin na mag-solve ng, or hindi sila sanayin na mag-solve ng gantong problem. At yung mata nila ay parang hindi karaniwan sa anila yung mga gantong klaseng given. Kaya much better, you need to practice about order of operations. Let's continue with number 2. In number 2, simplify. 1 half the quantity of 128 minus 84 plus 128 minus 84 minus 1 half 128 minus 84. Now for this problem, may shortcut dito, pero, pero papakita ko rin sa inyo yung, yung long cut. Long cut muna tayo, or yung normal solution tayo. Since order of operations to, we will start first with the parentheses. So I will copy 1 half. First, first solution tayo ah times the, the difference of 128 minus 84, which is 44. And then plus 128 minus 84 is also 44. Minus 1 half ulit times the difference of 128 minus 84. So that is 44. So what will happen here? Unayin muna natin itong 1 half times 44. Pero mag-cancellation na kayo dito guys ha. Yung 1 half minus 44 natin, yung can, can cancel 2, it will become 1. Yung 24 natin will become 22. So we have 22 plus 44 minus, as you can see, 1 half times 44 is 22. And ngayon, mapansin nyo, meron tayong pares 22 magkabilaan. 22 and the other is negative, so magiging 0 na lang to. And as you can see, the answer is only 44, which is letter C. Sir, paano naman sinasabi yung shortcut? 
So let me show you a shortcut about this. Para ma-realize nyo. Let me clear this part. Ah, sorry. Yan, clear natin yung sinulat ko dito. Ngayon, kung kapansin nyo, I think gusto mapansin nyo, eh. this part, itong part na to, and this part of the problem are the same. Kung may na-notice nyo. And, kung ipapadali natin siya, yung mismong idea about it, para lang siyang 1 minus 1. 1 minus 1. Meaning, if gusto natin shortcut to, pag na mismong nakita nyo na yung mismong problem, you can easily eliminate this in the given expression because they are additive inverse. Meaning, when you add them, their sum is equal to 0. So, what will remain is ito na lang. Yung 128 minus 84. And as you can see, the correct answer is 44. As simple as that, still, the correct answer is letter C. And by the way, guys, if you are um, planning to review for the civil service examination, we are offering different review packages for for you sa civil service examination. And you can search yung aking Facebook page, Ako si Teacher Gon. So I hope guys you learned something from this video. And if you're new to my channel, don't forget to like and subscribe, but hit na rin yung bell button for you to be updated sa ating latest uploads. Again, it's me, Teacher Gon. Maraming maraming salamat. Bye-bye!